Uh, this is an interview with some lads. So I'm Lewis Grice and I play the guitar in the band. My name's Blake Merrick, I play guitar and sing for the band. I'm James Revit and I play drums. I'm Darrell Wilcox and I play bass. And what's this band? In Silence We Crave. Quick, why we just sort of clicked? Yeah. I don't know if you guys would say the yeah. same. But like you're gonna, you, you sit there thinking, oh, fuck's sake, man, we're gonna like, we're gonna be here for ages before we get ready for another gig. And pretty much after like the first or second practice, we were like, right, yeah. let's Standing go. tight. Let's right. have it. I mean, me and Darrell sort of started music at the same time as well in, this, in the same school. So yeah. we've been playing together on and off for like oh, pretty best, much the whole best time. Part of seven. Eight years now. So like when when I basically got asked by Darrell, do you want to join a band with me? We've got a gig in a few weeks. I was like, absolutely. Go on then. Yeah. <laughs> I got nothing on. I think at the moment, like the chemistry, musically especially, because that's the most important part as well. Like, we all could just smash, smash it out, piece of piss. <laughs> Without music, I'd be I'd be so depressed, mate. <laughs> I'm annoyed now because I haven't got my headphones with me because they don't fit inside my phone. I, I'm oh, all I do is listen to music, genuinely, and play games. But we'll ignore that part. Music is my entire life, and being being autistic, it controls my emotions from day to day. So it's critically important for me. For me, I think I'd probably. Um, I, I wouldn't really do very much with my life because I'm not really into sport and I'm not really uh, in, into much creative in terms of like drawing or anything like that. So this is really my only sort of creative outlet. So um, writing and performing music. I mean, I, I got into performing music with my last band and I mean, now I wouldn't sort of be able to imagine a life where I wasn't doing it. Two eyes and two goes. Thanks for help with the actual eyes. Right, that's <laughs> It's hard one to describe because I, ever since such an early age, I've been doing music, so I can't really imagine not doing it, if you know what I mean. Yeah. It's just been there the whole time. <laughs> so, I mean, for me, I mean, I'm. I think personally I'm quite lucky in terms of my lifestyle and you know the, the, the house and stuff that I was brought up in and the fact that I've come from a privileged family if, yeah. compared to most people. Um, I mean I, I don't think we've ever had a, a moment where we thought we were going to sort of get evicted from the house or um, not have enough food in the fridge and stuff like that so in that sense obviously um, for me I don't think it has to be emotional. I think I escape um, perhaps things that I'm that I'm wanting to avoid and stuff like that just through playing music and I think it's sort of more about um, actually just sort of outpouring how I feel about anything not just sort of a poor lifestyle and stuff like that like I said um, but yeah I, I would say it's a good way to escape just as much as some people would go and escape through drinking and some people would go and escape through drugs I think music is a yeah, it's, yeah. A, it's a healthy alternative healthy alternative it's, it's a weird thing it's hard to describe to people who aren't 
you know in music themselves or do music themselves it's like when you when you're playing it you you do almost go into a different world and you lose all concepts of like you know stuff like what time or day it is it's really weird but like i remember just like the other week i was playing just to like some backing track i was like i'll do this for 10 minutes i played with along to it i was like okay that was cool I looked at the time and like nearly an hour and a half had passed but to me it felt like two minutes and like during that time i was only focused on what i was doing it's is quite a zen thing.